Nawab Zera from Jaisek Global 2022. As a guest, I have with me Bernard Montel. He is Technical Director, Europe, Middle East and Africa and Security Strategist at Tenable. We will have a conversation with him and we will get to know more about the cybersecurity threats the region is facing. So let's welcome Bernard and TechX Media. Hi, how are you? I'm very happy to be here. Thank you. Yeah, it's a pleasure to have you here with us. So Bernard, let's start uh, with uh, let's start with talking about the threats Europe, Middle East, Middle East and Africa region is facing currently, and how can organizations prepare themselves to combat those cyber threats? So let's first uh, begin with one threat, which is related to the remote workers. You know, yeah. two years ago, we've been forced to work from home. And that will never disappear. Because, and that, that happened overnight. Yeah, and, and even if it happened two years ago, mm. we think organization will continue to have remote workers in a sort of hybrid, you know, uh, work. Mm. And that represents the first threat that we can see from organizations because now, you know, people are using the home network and the home network is definitely not secure. Yes, true. So, uh, yes, the trend will continue. We are still, um, a lot of organizations are still practicing that hybrid work environment. So, are there any specific solutions Tenable is offering um, uh, to, uh, protect, um, uh, to protect organizations in that scenario? Now that the attack surface has moved to this place, you know, we have to continue to be able to offer uh, scanning of this network and we've launched, for example, a form factor of Nessus, which is our well-known scanner, yeah. into the form of a Raspberry Pi, mm -hmm. uh, which is one of the answer. The second answer is the fact that when people are attacked from home, uh, attackers want to steal identities and being able to access the corporate network you know, yes, yes. through the VPN. But what they want to do at the end of the day, they want to target Active Directory to get privileged accounts. So at Tenable, we also have the solutions which is capable of covering, uh, preventing, you know, and detecting vulnerabilities around the Active Directory, solutions called Tenable AD, which is looking after misconfigurations mm -hmm. that allow attackers to get privileged accounts. Excellent, excellent. So uh, Bernard, let's talk about a Tenable research that showed that uh, 40 billion records were vulnerable in 2021. So as we are in 2022 now, what kind of vulnerabilities are there in organizations, infrastructure, IT infrastructure, and what can be done uh, to protect uh, organizations' IT infrastructure? So that was a huge number. Mm -hmm. And if you go back to, that's yeah. a global number. Yes, if you okay. go back to EMEA, we count roughly 480 mm -hmm. breaches. Oh. public breaches. So we imagine that we can add another 20% mm -hmm. of the non-public breaches. And those are the records attached to it. That's huge. Now, we see two main kind of attacks. We see the physical supply chain and the software supply chain. Mm -hmm. The software supply chain, we know it with SolarWinds mm -hmm. or Log4j. But the physical supply chains are targeting mainly critical infrastructures, you know, oil and gas, mm -hmm. but not, you know, the power supplier, the water supplier, healthcare. Yeah. Those are the ones that can really touch people and not only, you know, uh, software. So those are the very two main trends that we see. Again, in EMEA, uh, we see three main domains. Mm -hmm. The government, okay. education, and healthcare oh. are the top three today covered by those breaches we just mentioned. So government, education and healthcare are the three main vulnerable industries at the moment. So as Bernard, we are at JISEC Global 2022. Uh, why JISEC is important for Tenable? Can you tell us about your presence here? What kinds of solutions you are showcasing? So um, it's important because this is the more important event yes. in the region. Um, uh, number one, we are super proud that we are here every year. Uh, it represents not only Dubai, it represents the whole Middle East. And oh, then, uh, you know, it's covering um, the, the complete picture that we can have, sharing with our customers and partners as well, you know, uh, our vision and the solutions. Um, Tenable has made some very important acquisition in 2021. 
uh, around Active Directory, but also around the cloud. Uh, we know that Saudi, for example, is, a, is one of the, of the countries that has, you know, invests recently more in the cloud. So that's although also a part of the attack surface we want to cover. Uh, so it, it was important because we've launched these new cloud security solutions called Telebus CS in February, which is very close to us. And it was important that JITEC, we can, you know, explain that to our customers and partners. That's, that's very interesting. And thank you so much for being here with us and sharing this, for sharing this valuable information with us. And we hope to have you again with TechX in the future. Thank you very much. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned to TechX to know more about what is happening at JASEC Global 2022. Goodbye.